Um. So, conclusion on Nilo. Um, teams like this aren't like good. They're just you like Nilo and you want to make her work in single target. Generally, she's an AOE unit. She's good in AOE. She's pretty bad in single target. She's gonna get better with Nahida. Honestly, don't go for her unless you just really like her character. If you want to pull her for meta reasons, wait for her rerun once Nahida's out, once potentially other Hydro units or Dendro units that synergize with her are out. Because right now, meh. Meh. Pretty meh. Don't be a loser. Subscribe. Give people a good feel for how strong this kind of stuff is. Because people don't build their characters properly, so they see, wow, you can two-rotate the overworld Diova shop? That's pretty decent. No, it's not. This is so fucking terrible for a min-maxed signature weapon level 90 double-crowned character. This is very, 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 very bad. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Nice. <laughs> nice. We can turn the Hey, it's it's not the highest cheap DPS, no. Are you saying like what's your point? I think it's point? still like, better the... overall. <laughs> okay, I mean maybe. What's why? Basically, um, it's really like not that far behind. But sure. because it's like front loads your it front loads your damage and your burst when you're at high investment, it means that your Dude. damage is more front loaded. And that's yeah, well that's why hard. I run Tino Blast on him. So, like, it makes sense. But also, dude, it doesn't... I feel like when you're at high enough investment, literally all I fucking do with Child is Q... Like, I'll do that rotation. In two seconds, it's over, and then I don't have any burst for the next chamber. Because, like, Q, 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 and then they're all dead. Yeah. So, you can go ER Sands on, on Emblem, and that way you have your burst back.